Good morning, everybody. Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Tiffany Beast from Beauty and the Beast. It's when I upload every single Sunday and Wednesday. Today, we're doing a good old fashioned day in the life. The little twist is that it's Friday, which is like my favorite day because I love that the kids have off for the weekend and just feels like work is wrapping up. And I, don't know, I just love Fridays. Plus, it's March 1st, so I'm so happy. I feel like we made it through the winter and we're finally healthy. I'm mean, not gonna Two out of four of my kids had. Oh, uh, there we go. Jinx. I, <laughs> norovirus. <laughs> well, how else could I tell you that the kids had? Well, they had a stomach bug. I'm assuming it's norovirus because it's going around like crazy. But. We got Probably don't get it. What? Don't say that. <laughs> anyway, we're gonna get their breakfast, maybe lunch is packed, and then we will catch back up. Thank you. Need the paper towels down for us. Thank Thanks, you. Babe. <laughs> You're the best. Thank you so much. She was line leader in school. Now her job is paper towel girl. Hey. Are you tired, baby? Can I hold you? safely off to school I'm gonna show you my favorite breakfast I have like a couple of meals that like I'm loving right now one I'm like you can consider a meal I think I made it in my last video it's like my like yogurt snack that I really like but right now I'm gonna show you my breakfast that I'm currently obsessed with I go through phases with food and like just crave it every day and that's where I'm at with this let me show you so I did go ahead and do a brain dump just on like my notes app on my phone because I was like shutting down not even knowing like what I'm what all I need to get done, what's going on. It's that time of year where like schools and like dance schools and stuff and like even soccer, like trying to get like that end of school year stuff in, like planning. Okay, it's right there in front of you, sweetheart. This is avocado. You want some avocado? Yeah? <laughs> so, this is mom, like I, I like forget what I'm talking about. Um, so, so soccer, like they're planning a tournament right now. We just got, um, tonight we have our costume try on for dance and then they just put in like the recital date and location and it's like little things so I was like sorry to put stuff in my calendar plus it's the first day of the month okay baby it's the first day of the month so like I have like reset stuff I want to do I want to refill out like my March calendar 
I my mood, just the fact that it is March, is like I'm so happy. Like honestly, it's, you know, hard thing to say after your family is getting over stomach virus, but I just feel so happy, and I feel like it's gonna be time to be at the bay before we know it, and all of that. And our big exciting outing of the day is birdhouse shopping. Literally, I don't know if that's how you know you're 35 or what, but like I, I'm, I'm literally so excited to get a birdhouse today. I've been wanting one for like two years. <laughs> yeah, and we need to also get bird food for the outside bird feeder. Out back, we have a bunch of robins. I just, I love bird watching. You know that I love it being at the bay because there's all of uh, the ducks and the swans and just like, I'm excited too because this year, um, I'm hoping we can get to the bay for spring break. Last year they were doing like all of the renovations, so we couldn't go, but everybody that I spoke to down there, we never got to have a spring down there. Everybody that I spoke to down there was like, in spring is like when you see all the babies because they're all like, you know, starting, all the babies are starting to be born and look, the wildlife and just all of it is extra amazing that time of year. So anyway, this is just a half avocado, everything seasoning, and then I'm doing three egg whites. So back to today, or I have to do some work stuff, um, and then I want to do the birdhouse. Ella goes to dance right away, like gets off the bus on Fridays, and I, I sent her to school. We saw her cute little outfit today, and something that's appropriate for hip hop fest. Um, so that's like our thing on Friday. Here's my uh, three egg whites. My um, camera sorry. ran out of memory, so I had to delete some stuff. But Fridays are extra exciting because I get to see my sister because my niece is in dance with Ella, and it's just amazing a dream come true. Dropping eggs everywhere. So the secret to this, so basically you're, you're using avocado instead of mayonnaise. Counter is all dirty. And it's delicious, first of all, but my secret ingredient is Mike's Hot Honey. It's bomb. Let me show you. So good. I put this on like salmon, all different things, even just like a egg sandwich or whatever. So just a little bit because you don't want a ton of sugar, plus you don't need a lot. Um, and then I'm going to make some toast and put it on top of that. What well, would be even better is if I had a tomato, but I don't. So good, baby. So I'm just using Canyon Bakehouse. This is my favorite when I don't make homemade bread. I don't make homemade bread all the time because I just don't. Speaking of bread, I wish I could be a part of the homesteading community. It's like exploding right now and I'm here for it. I love it. I love all the sourdough. I love the chickens. I love all that stuff. It's just not in the cards for me, especially sourdough. I tried gluten-free sourdough and it basically just made a brick in my oven and it was not okay. So I heard some people can eat sourdough. It doesn't mess like with their gluten intolerance. So maybe one day I'll try. I definitely think that it's like, I don't know. I think it's just in some women to want to make sourdough, including me. quick nap it's early it's only 11 um almost 11 and she went to bed around like 10 45 but she's again just like getting over being sick and recovering so she's definitely feeling much better but she's catching up on sleep so one of the biggest things that has helped me i hope you can hear me okay one of the biggest things that has helped me with like my fitness and health journey is realizing it doesn't have to be perfect i used to be like if i didn't get it done at 5 30 in the morning then it couldn't happen and I've just changed my mindset completely. I fit it in wherever I can, even if I can only do like a quick 20 minute workout. Like Chris, do you have the kids while I go in the basement for 20 minutes and then like we'll take turns. So basically just like knowing that it has to get done but it doesn't have to be perfect, which I talk about a lot here, um, has been the biggest help. Also, this like all natural uh, pre-workout from Just Ingredients, it's expensive, but I feel like it definitely like helps me with my workouts and it's gonna taste really gross right now if I just brush my teeth. Yes, it does. Update, 
I got an exactly two minute and 45 second workout in before Everly woke up. And Chris was gonna go get her and he went up and she went at mommy. You know how that is. Sometimes she only wants dad. You never know what you're gonna get with your kids. I'm sure you guys can relate to that. So I decided to just come up here, wash my face, throw a sweatshirt on and get her in the car and do something. She also um, had, I can call it a brunch because she had an egg sandwich. And it's like not exactly lunch time, not exactly breakfast time. She already had a breakfast, so she's fed and she's like she's good to go for a ride. My hope is that she'll take a little car nap and just feel refreshed when she wakes up. Also, I'm so excited. Dime Beauty finally has the tinted wonder screen back in stock, and it's the best thing ever because I hate foundation. Like as I age, I just feel like foundation makes you look older. Hers is like so nice and like lightweight and moisturizing, and then it also has the sunblock in it. Plus, it's super affordable and last forever so i'll definitely have like anything um from today's video linked down below in the description box but this is my favorite i'm so happy to have it back this feels so good like there's just like a light glow nothing like you know what i mean like foundation just like seeps into your pores and shows like everything i don't like that i did get to post my little morning reel which then i put on as a youtube short from when um i had my breast ultrasound that morning. Just felt like doing a little vlog and I really liked it. Hope you guys like it too. Speaking of running out of things, I uh, we're also running out of fruit, which is the story of my life. Um, we go through fruit so fast and I don't like to buy too much at once because I don't want it to go bad either. So I'm hoping if Everly is in the mood or if she's napping and I can just run in and Christy's in the car with her, I'm hoping to run to Aldi and just grab some produce because I don't need like a full grocery shop. I mean, I'll just get some of my favorite Aldi things because I did Costco this week and Whole Foods, so I have a lot of groceries still. I'm still not sure what I'm going to make for dinner tonight. Babe, what do you want for dinner tonight? Pizza. Homemade pizza? I don't know. I was just trying to be like the kids. Oh. <laughs> we started watching this documentary last night and I'm obsessed with it because one, I grew up in the 90s, so it just reminded me of the 90s so much. And it's called Beckham. It's on Netflix and so I love that I get to see like Posh Spice, plus they like show a lot of 90s footage. And we didn't even finish the whole first episode, but I'm excited. And there's a lot more. There's like six or seven, I think. I'm excited about that because I'm loving it so far. What about like fajitas? That sounds good. Maybe that steak that's already made. That no, there's like five pieces left. Yeah, so somebody got a steak, shrimp, chicken. All right, pizza. I feel like I'm back like in the 2000s with my bump. It's looking like snooky. Just like throwing a little bit of makeup on genuinely gives me more life and makes me feel more productive. It's, it's true for me for some reason. It takes no time. Also, I'm really loving not having my extensions in. I feel like my hair is growing a lot. I've been taking um, the Mary Ruth liquid. I wanted to try it out and I, for me it's just like a little bit easier than taking four Nutrafol pills so so far so good it's a good taste too I also would love to grab a nice coffee and run in the thrift store again this is all depending on Everly's mood but I put like a little bit of a thrift store shop with me in my spring clean and decorate because I got like a really pretty vase there and like a bunny plate and like some Easter stuff and there was this beautiful house picture and I was like, oh, I don't really need this because, you know, I really like to make those over and like paint them. We only do it for like winter. I did like a Christmas one and a fall Halloween one. And I'm like, now I'm like, I really want to turn that into a spring picture with like cherry blossoms. And now I can't stop thinking about it and I doubt that it's there, but I still kind of want to look. Also, I know that at Home Depot, I'm going to see all the plants and I'm going to want all of them. It's hard though because... We plan on spending a lot of time at the Bay House, and I don't know, like, if I'll be able to transport things. In my hopes and dreams and wishes for that, I could make, like, little, um, I want to say flower beds, but not, like, for herbs. Like, little, little herb gardens that I could be able to transport to the Bay. When we had our old house, and I had, like, the zucchini and tomato out there, and the blueberry bushes, the kids would love to go out there and pick it, and that's just, like, my little homestead since I can't have a full blown farm with chickens. I would just love to do something like that. It's a bad time to talk. 
putting my perfume on too and just want to tell you like a random side note if you ever are on dime and you didn't use my link you can still just always use the code tiffany25 and that gives 25 percent off everything right, i'm done here let me clean up my mess let's get out of the house and get some coffee and hopefully at some point like two minute and 45 second uh workout i'm gonna end it i'm gonna like send my all my fitness friends on here tiffany finished a two minute workout um hoping i can still close my rings at some point today There's nothing I really want for lunch. Look at this cute little happy face. <laughs> so I'm just having two rice cakes with this delicious um, brownie batter granola butter. This is like uh, not my typical lunch, but it's what I have right now and I'm hungry. So I'm going to start with this. I'll probably make a protein shake. Chris, you're going to have leftover taco meat? Yeah. I'm just not feeling that right now. Two people to help us. Well, this is just one of the ones I'm getting. Definitely getting that one. For getting show. that the show. Wow. I want the um, ones with the camera, but they don't have it yet. Well, you're gonna have to go Look, ahead and order like one. Oh, we need there's, bird food. There's seven thousand options online, so like I've definitely looked to buy you I one know, at hard. least fifteen times, and I'm too scared to pick one. Hummingbirds. We got hummingbirds at the bay, not so much around here. Which one do you like, Evs? That one, just, just that one. I have no idea which one she pointed to. Babe, birds are small. Like, see that one right there, $18? Is that ugly? No. I kind of like it. I might paint it pink. No. <laughs> Our birds are basic. They want the white and black. Yeah, I think we need something like that on the front porch. All right, done. Get three of them. It's for your squirrels right now. That's awesome. No, it's literally a bird. You put the bird seed in there and they sit. I like it. I need to have it. Alright, this song's killing me. Oh my gosh, that would be amazing. <laughs> Looks good. <laughs> if you wanted to test it out. Too bad it wouldn't fit our whole family, right? Okay. Sure it would. Lap up. <laughs> Drive? <laughs> he can't, Let's silly. Go. 
Want to give it to her? Thanks, bestie. What do, what do you do? How do you do it? And the just, outside, just right? Just like washing your hands, she always tells me. Front and back. You get it? <laughs> What's up, Feast? <laughs> All clean. I missed you. Coffee. Mm. Wow. So did I actually. You gonna get in your seat? What day? That's our garage door opener. It's already 2.50. Your siblings are going to be home soon. Are you excited to see your kids? Oh, crap. She's up in the back and the ladies walking Oh, out. Chicky. Sorry, that was our daughter. Oh. <laughs> Everly. <laughs> no more. Go sit in your seat, you stink. You almost hit somebody with the... <laughs> Sorry, please, ex that woman's face. please excuse our daughter <laughs> opening her. Oh, Holy goose. You take your jacket off? Yes. Ev, was yes. that fun? Silly. She really wanted that golf cart. What did she say? Let's go, dude. Yeah. <laughs> did Paw Patrol teach you that? Or did you just make it up? Let's go, bro. Paw Patrol. Paw Patrol. I'm running into Aldi real quick. My kids literally look forward to St. Patrick's Day just because it's the one day of year I let them have this. Successful shopping trip. All right, we are home. I'm pulling up the cameras outside so I can listen for the bus to come. Uh, but basically, as soon as Ella gets home, we have to go to dance. So I want to try to make the dough for pizza right now. Also, I did go to the thrift store. It was in and out. The picture wasn't there. Sad. Bummer. But let's make our two ingredient pizza dough. So simple, just need, um, I use organic Greek yogurt, whichever brand I can find at the time. So this time is Stony Field. And then I just use King Arthur's gluten free flour. That's literally it. Coming in. Um, I need a refill. I'm trying to find a refill of flour here. I do have Vivin up. More flour. Chris just came in uh, for a second to use the bathroom, but he was sitting in the driveway with Everly because she fell asleep the second that we got in the driveway. Literally, the second we got in the driveway. So our hope is to be able to use our pizza oven. We'll see if that actually happens because I think Chris said he needs to clean it, but let's make this dough. It's a good thing our kids decided not to buy lunch today because they'd be having pizza twice, which I don't think they would mind at all. So it's one one cup of plain Greek yogurt um, and one and a half cups of self-rising flour. I just use the King Arthur's gluten-free measure for measure. And then usually do about like four cups. How many cups are in here? So basically this whole thing of yogurt is three and a half cups. I'm just trying to think if I have any more yogurt because I think four cups would probably be best for us, but we'll see. Yeah, that'll be perfect. We'll do four cups. My math isn't mathing today. else here is so excited for grilling season that's my favorite um, we have the Blackstone at the Bay and I do love it it still just feels weird because I'm so used to like a regular grill but it works out great because we're always hosting family and friends so we can just make a huge like pancake and bacon breakfast out there and make dinners out there and all that stuff but basically the grill that we have here is on its way out it's just like the whole bottom is burnt out and like falling down um, we've had it for about six years or so, which I don't know how long a grill is supposed to last, but I know nothing these days lasts. I'm not trying to be negative, just being truthful. Um, nothing is made the way that it used to be made. But basically, I'm torn if we're going to get a new grill here or another, like, Blackstone. I don't know. I just like the grill marks and, like, 
traditional grill too, so it's hard. I'm not sure. I wish there was like a hybrid blackstone. Time to get our hands dirty. Where are my kids? Ella has to be to dance in 20 minutes. Her, their bus gets home so late. It's crazy. Tonight is costume try-ons at dance, so it's extra exciting. Also, with this dough, you can see here, like a little, a little dry still, kind of keep kneading. And you can also add a little bit of warm water if you want. I think I'm gonna let this be for now. And then when Chris is making the pizzas while we're at dance, if he decides it needs a little bit of water at that point, he can go ahead and do that. And let me clean up my mess, get her a snack ready. She likes to watch her iPad on the way there, which is completely fine with me. I'm like, I try to be balanced between screen time and other things, but I know that like when I'm done a long day of work or like, you know, and I just want to veg out and like have some me time. So I'm perfectly fine with her watching her iPad on the way to dance. Using my Swedish dishcloth by uh, Vassier Beauty, Brittany Vassier. Her brand is, oh my gosh, why am I blanking right now? Beltaire, I don't, I'm my brain. Her brand is Beltaire and she makes so much amazing stuff. I feel like I don't have like a ton of YouTube friends. I look at lots of people that I talk to, um, but like I don't have a ton of friends, but I will say Brittany is a real one and she's always just been the same person and she's always been really kind and helpful in any way. I don't know. I just can really appreciate somebody like her. We're both cancers, so I feel like cancers unite. <laughs> Easy peasy. Of course, we're gonna like when once the actual crust is set, is shaped, we're gonna add like garlic, salt, whatever kind of spices you want. Also, I'm 10 out of 10 excited. 20 out of 10. Oh, the kids are home. Excited to um, plant my seeds and get my birdhouse set up. Hi, babies! I missed you. Well, I like the new camera. You like my new camera? Thanks, baby. Mm -hmm. How was your day? Great, amazing, cool. Oh, awesome. I found my plush. Hi, beautiful queen. Aw, oh, isn't that sweet? It's the weekend. Sweet. Wear another jacket. So, hi, buddy. I <laughs> All right, got my bestie back. How was your day today? Good. Good? Right now I'm eating Kit Kat. Daddy let you have a Kit Kat, huh? Hoping that we can have pizza night and popcorn movie night. Gotta make sure that Evie is all the way healthy first. We don't want to have her getting a sick bug, right? Are you excited to try your costume one? Yeah. Me too. All right, I'll let you relax and unwind. We're home. Dance was great. Chris is making us pizza. I'm 10 out of 10 hungry. This one's not not shaping out too well. Does that look great? Right? Okay, it will taste good. Um, can you make it in a butterfly shape for me? It's supposed to be Italian. <laughs> this is, this is no bueno. I mean, that, is this that the right word? is a joke. <laughs> no. That's Spanish, but... It is. <laughs> Worst Italian ever. Genuinely. Right, that enough gravy for you? Alright. I know. The it's accent, like okay. it's all just... Smush it around with my hands, eh? <laughs> this is gonna keep recording you. It's your cooking show. Love the pink spoon. Yes, queen. That's all there is in this kitchen. <laughs> yeah. What is going on? What? Let daddy in! What happened? Uh, none of the flour stayed on it. So it's not sliding off. Oh man. I'm gonna have to use like a... Santa's got the dance, dancing bug over there. Um, I just wanted to show you that the pizzas are getting better. That's probably the best one yet. But the kids are eating it, so I'm happy with it. Guys, do you like the pizza? I got one more to make. Good. I haven't had a piece yet. It's I will. Good. It's good, but what? Not that good. It's moist. Ew. On that note.
<laughs> so cute. You ready to say goodbye to that chair? That chair's been with us since. Hold on. Turn the sound machine off for a second. So loud in the background a bit. When did, when Ella was a baby? We didn't have it for the boys. I don't Car know if it was Ella or Emily. With Carter, we legit had a rocking chair. I need spray for your hair, Princess Pie. Tanner, we, we upgraded to an Ikea chair. And then this bad boy. It's been through a lot. It's gotten us through a lot of, a lot of nights. But it's about time. Come on. We're doing a room refreshing here probably next week. It's gonna look way different. Okay. Let's try again. What's she trying? I don't know. She has to run from really far away to get to me. Cannonball. <laughs> That was a great cannonball. You're the cutest. I was trying right. to talk her into going to swim class again. Abby's Do you want to go back fish. to swim class? No. Come on, you're so good at it. Oh, sleepy baby. Am I allowed to put your toothpaste on your toothbrush for you tonight, or you have to do it? Yeah. Oh, I can do it? Wow. Feel special. You got the hiccups? Rah! Did I get them out? Get out. Boom. Can't wait to your part. How did you get so beautiful? Ready to brush your teeth? And then we'll go night night. I know you're sleepy baby, so I'm gonna go with you, big girl. I love you so much. So I